Hey there guys, what is up? It's me Zephyr again. Don't worry, I'm gonna get right into the video. You guys can just listen to my voice. Just make sure you do follow everything on screen. I'm gonna try and get through this as quick as I can. So the personal ID record I used is gonna be 30. If it's a guy, I'm not, I can't remember. I don't think it's a guy, but if it's a guy, then just change the female. So the body type is actually the gender. Obviously, we can't say gender anymore because reasons. Anyways, <laughs> yeah, the body type is completely up to you. If you wanna use face tattoos, that's up to you. If you don't want enough freckles, that's up to you as well. Change whatever you like. I shouldn't have to say it, but I'm always going to say it, so. so we want a pale face go for the pale face head shapes number three and yeah leave it like that hairstyle number 29 uh hair color will be 20 uh sorry six the eyes uh so the scale where it says up and down make sure that's the biggest you want them big eyes eye number is eight and then eye color is number four eyebrows is number seven brow color is number 10 forehead is one i feel like forehead and ears are just who cares you know just just do whatever and the nose yeah the, the nose you do want to change a lot of stuff so here is the just make sure you change the bars to what it is it's number one you can make it more extreme like bent but i feel like doing too much would you, it just makes you look like michael jackson and i, I don't want that and it makes your nose look too sharp cheeks number eight you could edit this part because i didn't really edit much so if you want to play around with it go for it the mouth is number eight teeth one jaw three we kept it in the middle in terms of it being narrow and then it's a bit forward just a little bit you could do it maybe a little bit more if you can look just behind the ears or underneath the ears you can see what it does so you don't want it to be like this because then it's just too sharp you know and the other way we could work as well they both work like you can either go left or right but what i'd say is don't go too far to the right and too far to the left we put it all the way up uh putting it down is it just makes you look it's more of like a manly feature the chin we made it narrow left the others around the middle and it's number two the neck you can make it narrow if you want sure let's let's go make it narrow if you, if you want to put any jewelry go for it yeah we put freckles and the freckles intensity and the color is the most important part if you overdo it it's gonna look bad not that it's gonna look bad but it's just it's too much you know i don't know because for me in real life i have freckles yeah i know a lot of people notice it unless they come up close yeah mine is like that so it's, it could really go unnoticed but yeah there you go and that's number five not sure if i said it right cheeks we put number two and we change the color to this it, 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 cheeks is like a sort of like a blush makeup or I, I don't know i'm not i don't know makeup or i'm not in the makeup world so whatever it is you want to make it a little bit red you don't want to make it too red it's like right now like you, you wouldn't even know that she's got that blush makeup on so that's the you want it to look natural you know you don't want to look like a clown lipstick base number two uh you can leave that number one as well and uh, lipstick accents i put i put this on i'm not sure if you actually did anything play around with it <laughs> but not that serious so the eyeshadow upper and the eyeshadow lower they're both four and they're both maxed out on the intensity and the color so the eyeliner is also maxed out and it's number six eyeliner lower intensity is two the color is maxed out the reason why i did that is because i don't want it to cover up the full eye too much you know it's overdoing it whereas if you leave it like this six. i don't know looks better for me i'll leave the side and that's it yeah the dirt is whatever so yeah with a build like this i'll probably go for like a scientist build obviously it depends on how much you want to go with your role play i mean by all means you can use rpgs and rocket launchers or you can punch people in the face but i don't know for me this looks like a scientist so i'll probably go for like a passive build with this no combat just try and speak to people and persuade them and you know sneak around and they really passive <laughs> well that's been it for me guys hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video if there's anything else that i missed out if there's anything that i need to change or do be sure to let me know i'd be more than happy to do it if you guys have any questions let me know down below yeah i'm also thinking of doing like celebrities as well or lookalikes or i don't know I might, I might go down that route as well so if you guys do have any ideas on who i can do or who you'd want to see feel free to let me know down below as well if you guys did enjoy this video you know what to do show the love show the support until next time guys i'll see you guys later